Hi, I'm Josie Severson. I'm a textile and surface designer based out of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Um, I have been doing textile design for over four years now. Textile design is basically what is on top of the surface of the textiles, what is woven into the textiles. There are many different ways that you can incorporate a design into textiles themselves. I got started in textile design because originally I wanted to be a fashion designer. I always loved fashion. I loved it because it was a way to express yourself. It was a way for people to do whatever they wanted. Um, it's just something that you can choose and make your own. That's what I'm interested in. People being able to choose something that was made and making it themselves so that it becomes a personal expression. Um, when I went to school for fashion design, however, I understood that there was something else called textile design, but it was nothing that I even had considered before. Um, but I had always drawn. That was the that was the interesting part, is that I'd never even thought that it was something that I would go into, but here, half my life, I've been creating these repeating patterns, and it became a very natural thing for me to do. The reason that I'm talking to you today is that I have an exciting new project. I have a dress that I would like to make from my fabrics. This dress is very versatile, very simple. This is supposed to be an everyday, every night type of dress. Simple style, pull on, pull off, but it concentrates on the print itself. Because I've been involved with printing textiles for a few years now, I do understand that there are a lot of unrelated costs that you don't realize that are involved with manufacturing anything. Primarily for this dress, it would be going to the manufacturer itself in LA, and it requires 200 pieces. I need to make 200 pieces in order to have this factory even look at um, being able to make it for me. This is a new thing for me. I have never created a garment before. I wanted to be a fashion designer originally, instead I got into textiles. But now I'm hoping that I can eventually make my own clothes from my textiles. Just because there are enough people that enjoy my work and I feel like it, it's a natural progression from what I do. But um, even though I have great help behind me and great advisors, I know that it's going to take a lot of resources, including time and energy and money that are involved in creating this one piece. Not unlike the satisfaction I get from seeing somebody create something from my fabrics, I can imagine somebody walking down the street with this dress on. And that would give me as much happiness and excitement as anything else because I can see somebody taking that dress and putting their own jewelry with it, putting their own shoes with it, and making it their own. And that is exactly what it all comes back to, is that we all have a need for expression. We all have a little bit of that creativity in us and we have a desire to, to do what we want with it. And I think creating things that help people do that is, is the reason why I'm doing this to begin with. Again, this is Josie Severson. I am the founder of Home Fashion Fabrics based in Minneapolis, Minnesota. I have my retail showroom on 1008 Marquette Avenue across from the Hilton. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you watching this and, and any efforts would, would be wonderful. Thank you.